high. Here you see a shoulder bridge rocks activation pattern to get better posture, to get more straight arm confidence and your transfer from your upper body through your core into your lower body. So straight arm, real delts and shoulder girdle area is very important for overall stance, for a good stance to prevent all kind of spine injuries and all kind of other stiffness. So keep up training in the leg activation pattern with straight legs or with bent legs. Do this activation to your hip activation and for your overall anterior pelvic tilt area activation. You can increase your pattern with a wider activation in a straight line stance with also straight arms at the ground. I do this often a few times per week and I go always for a good posture and the activation in a medium stance, my bridge position. Then I move my hips into the air and squeeze my glutes and all my hip area and my general core. So keep up activation in your leg position and a wider stance and also alternating legs with straight legs complete in the air and also do different leg pattern to get into this full glutes activation and this complete lower body transfer into your core. So this posture activation is a great way to get a nice confident stance and a real delts activation in your shoulder girdle. So keep up training, shoulder bridge rocks, it's a full posture movement for better overall stance and in your lower back and keep up training. If you like this content, give a thumb up, subscribe my channel. I wish you a nice day. See you. Ciao.